in this video we are going to learn how to create driver switch in blender so let's start as you can see so if you want the project file link in description okay you can buy me a coffee for that as well so if i select this gear and rotate along z axis notice it is rotating okay that's a good thing but if i click on play uh, nothing is happening so what i want that i want to give it rotation from my frames and i want to control the speed by using this switch let's see select this gear go to the frame and type hash remember hash is necessary and click and type frame and enter uh, so it's driver attached so if i click on play notice it is rotating but the speed is constant and i want to control it how can i do that one way is that i you know multiply and divide by some value to increase or decrease the speed okay but the issue is that i want to control it dynamically for example with this switch so how i can do that so to do it select this gear move this upward go in drivers after that select z rotation because i am dealing with z move downwards okay click on add input variable now click on here click on transform channel why transform channel because i want to take my value from you know x axis y axis z axis rotation so these are called transform channels okay from where i want to take this transform channel value i want to take it from this cylinder so i will select this and select this one okay now this is this is called where okay what axis i want to control x axis notice it is x axis where it can move okay now what i will do i will type where here notice it is stop okay why it is stop you see if i select this thing press n its x value is zero but if i increase this value it is rotating if i increase further it look like it's slow but reality it is not slow it is just it is rotating too fast that uh, my computer is not able to do it for example if i lower the value notice it is rotating quite fast at 0 0.1 meter imagine how fast it is rotating at 0.54 or other values it is just it is rotating too fast that my computer can't you know so do it so what i can do select this multiply by 0.1 again now i can control its speed much better so what will happen if i increase sorry make it zero select this so if i increase this value notice it is working now quite great this time so if i increase this value again notice how fast it is rotating so in that way you can make a custom switch as per your requirement okay and one more advice suppose you are moving your suppose in my case it is here exactly x is zero suppose your switch location is here so make sure always apply location transform okay how to apply it select this press ctrl a and apply location just in case if your initial x value is not zero as you can see if i put zero it stop working if i put minus 0.5 it is rotating in a positive direction so you can you know control it as per your requirement so i hope you guys learned something from this video if you have any kind of doubts and queries feel free to ask thanks for watching and have a great day namaste